Hamilton has height, he has weight, he has reach in both the arms and the legs over Shmilino Rama. And our access experts fight gauge. Striking goes to Rama, ground game goes to Hamilton, speed goes to Prince Rama, strength goes to Anthony Hamilton, endurance goes to Hamilton because Rama hasn't been proven beyond the first round. Remember to listen to my commands at all times and to protect yourself at all times. Fight clean, fight hard, touch them up if you like, come out of my command. Vern Gorman, the final instructions. Nobody thinks this one will go Fire. the distance. Not even MFC President Mark Pavlich, who tweeted out that Timekeeper. if this one does go the distance, he will buy everyone in the house here a drink. Expensive bar tab. The closing odds for this one, Smilino Rama, the favourite at minus 390. They come back on Hamilton at plus 270. MFC heavyweight championship on the line. Rama in South Paul starts. Michael Chabello, Pat Militich with you. Rama usually explosive with his fist. He does have the tattoo of Mike Tyson on his stomach. Hamilton looks for a takedown early on. Rama gets back to his feet. Good balance by Rama hitting that wizard. Getting Hamilton off balance. Let's see how Prince Rama handles the biggest opponent he has ever fought, both in height and weight. Rama grabbed the corner post once and then hung his arm over the rope once. Saved his takedown. Hamilton supremely confident. Stay inside that ring. You stay inside see, the Hamilton ring. Hamilton lifting that underhook. That wrestling experience teaches you to do that. Smolino looking for a knee. Hamilton dropping down, looking for a double perhaps. Don't grab the shorts. Stay, get your foot inside now. Smolino glancing now. up at the big screens here in the arena to better gauge his position as the head pops out there from Anthony Hamilton. And Smolino throws a knee. Hamilton trains one of his own. Get inside. Get inside. And again, Rama's going to be cautioned here for grabbing those ropes. Grabbing a hold of that giant arm, seeing if he can get a key lock started. Hamilton looks for the takedown, gets it. Smolino Rama on his back. And he's almost mounted by a man of 264 pounds. Indeed he is. Not where Rama wants to be. No, you don't want a horse like this on top of you. Everything clean. Two big right hands from Hamilton. Rama trying to get off his back, trying to get the big man off of him. What he's doing, he's trapping the arm and trying to trap the leg, take both posts on the same side and roll it. It's called an Upa. It's day one stuff in jujitsu. And he actually might get out of here. Holy cow. Rama now, top position, lands two right hands. And Hamilton pulls the head out again. Hamilton looks like he might be fatigued a little bit. Hamilton looking for a tie clinch perhaps. No, gives up on that option. There's a cut. I believe it may be on the head of Anthony Hamilton. Clean on the ropes. Clean on the ropes. And maybe over the right eye actually of Smolino Rama. We'll try and get a better look. Indeed it is over the right eye of Smolino Rama. Rama working hard to get the heck off those ropes. Hamilton is a big, nasty fighter. He'll go to work on that right eye of the Prince. In the corner of Hamilton, Travis Brown barking instructions. That's where they bounced off the ropes. Rama took advantage of it where Hamilton could have. Rama with a high knee. Hamilton takes a deep breath. He may also be cut to the side of the right eye, Anthony Hamilton. And the freight train goes for a gut-munching knee. Hamilton is, he is fatigued. Rama gets and caught with the right hand. Not enough stunts behind it though from Hamilton. Now yeah, Rama stuck his tongue out after he got hit. I don't know if it rocked him at all, but his tongue was hanging out. Hamilton trying to pull that head down, maybe for a meet and drink knee, and Rama breaks up. Twice Both now. Both taking deep breaths. Yeah, twice now, Michael. We've seen good footwork by Rama to get the heck out of that rope situation, get the big guy off of it. Rama tight clinch, trying to decapitate him with the knee. Single leg from Hamilton, can't execute a takedown. He's just not committing. He's just reaching out and grabbing. Watch your hands. Both men breathing heavily here. Watch Still one minute 35 Watch. remains in the first. Wild hooking Watch punch off the left. On the then one off the right from Smilino Rama. Hamilton's tired, I think. Use more fakes, more fakes out of Rama. Get him out of position. That's clever from Rama to go to the body pack. Yes, absolutely. And then goes to the head of Hamilton and tags him. Smilino Rama spinning hook kick. How about that from a heavyweight? Got himself taken down with it, though. High risk move. Hamilton looking to pass guard here on the right side of the body of Smilino Rama. Hamilton needs to be smart here. Make him carry his weight more, land some elbows, do some damage, and win this round. One minute remains. First round set for five. 
Don't forget, Smolino Rama has never been out of the first round. He has finished all six opponents inside the first round so far. Hamilton with more fights, been out of the first round several times, obviously, and he's the one that looks tired right now. Hamilton back inside the guard of Rama. Rama, one thing about him, he packs a lot of weight into a small frame, 250 pounds. It's because of his really strong, thick legs and hips. He uses them well also. Some elbows here from Smolino Rama. What is troubling is that cut over the right eye of Rama. At the moment, it's running down the side of his head, and surely the doctor will take a look at it in a few moments' time. Not a lot of steam left on Hamilton's punches right now. Rama's made him work very hard. Rama trying to stay busy off of his back here. Hamilton looking to posture up with that left hand. Quickly, End of the first quickly. round, we go to the That's towels. Right. Hamilton have to work very hard. Four times, even that time, Rama grabbed the ropes to avoid the takedown, so Hamilton had to work extra hard to finally get him down to the ground. It does burn a lot of energy doing that stuff. Here's Hamilton throwing a big right hand. Rama sticking his tongue out, but doing a good job. Heavy hips like we talked about with Rama. Doing a good job getting that underhook in and bumping Hamilton off. Alina Rama will, for the first time ever in his career, go into the second round. Hamilton still blowing heavy here. Mark Pavlich may have a very big bar tab if we go the distance. Second of five. Southpaw stance, Milino Rama. Hit the head with a tree trunk, brother. Oh! My word! That was outstanding! Anthony Hamilton breaks down in tears in front of that poetry position. So much emotion flowing through him here. Smolino Rama has been knocked out for the first time, beaten for the first time. He's still on the legs. That was awesome. And Rama definitely has no clue where he's at right now. Hey, great time to throw it. It's right at the end of the round or beginning. Talk about a clean shot. Rama was done. A highlight real knockout of the highest order here. Do you realize how big that leg is coming through on your chin? The hard yards in training, sparring Travis Brown, sparring John Jones, and the whole team just into the way. Look at Brown's response at the knockout. Elation in the corner of Anthony Hamilton, who is now the MFC heavyweight champion. Travis Brown showing how much work they put into Hamilton. A lot of happiness. Amazing, amazing knockout. That's the strap that will soon be around the waist of Anthony Hamilton. My word, everybody here at the Shaw Conference Center still in a state of shock at that one. Alex Heimarsh, make it all official. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Van Gorman stops the bout at 12 seconds of the second round. The winner by knockout and the new MFC Heavyweight Champion of the World, Anthony Hamilton! Anthony Hamilton improves his record to 11-2. and two. What a victory for the big man. It looks like Jason Greger is going to have a chat now with our new MFC Heavyweight Champion. We are here with the champion, Anthony Hamilton. Anthony, it's like a tree trunk, as Michael Chevallo said, coming to the head of Smolino Rama. I wanted to watch that and set us up how you saw that high kick coming. Well, my corner, Travis Brown, has beautiful kicks. He's one of the best heavyweights in the world, if not the best. 
I train with him all the time, along with John Jones, Andre Olaski, and Frank Mir. These guys are beasts, man. And these guys are the ones that helped me get to where I am today. So when you come out of the sec start the second round, you looked like you were a little fatigued. Did you see something in the first round where they told you to set that up and go right at it early in the second? Well, my corner, Travis, told me that he dropped in his hands. He was tired. So I figured that I could throw a one-two to set up the kick and just go right by him, and it caught him just right. Well, Anthony, that's the first of three titles. The, uh, the next two boats got a lot to live up to. Hell of a bite. Congratulations. Thank you. I just want to say thank you to my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, all my friends and family at home. I love you guys. My teammates, Jackson's MMA, Albuquerque. Yo, Ivan Salivary MMA, Seattle, Washington. I love you guys. Thank you. Michael, back to you.